Hi, it's the second day of Christmas, and I'm gonna tell you about one of Creative Memory's newest tools. It's our um, rolling cart. And this one, Advisors designed for you to be perfect. Um, our company took all of our feedback. We didn't want it to be too big and too heavy. We didn't want it to be small, but we wanted it big enough to hold our biggest tools. We wanted it to have compartments for all of our little stuff. And it has done everything that we wanted and more. So let me um, take you through how I use this tool. This is a personal item. You're gonna organize it the way you want, but it is the bomb. So um, what I like to do is I like to put my lighter weight tools at the front, very accessible. All right, so for instance, if I'm gonna work on a page, who doesn't need the 12 inch trimmer, right? Um, however, when I'm done using my trimmer, it takes a lot of space. You have to find a place for it. What I've been doing is just putting it right back in the back. All right, and that way I always know what it is. Where it is. Same thing with my 12 inch trimmer, same thing with my border maker tool. So I just keep those very close to the front. It will transport my album, it will transport my pictures. Um, in here, I keep all of my, my organized, uh, like cardstock, for instance. Like, um, here's my black and white paper. Here's my um, platinum, bronze, and brown paper. So I keep my card stocks in there, and I also keep one of these um, Power Project folders in there with my, um, my things that I use the most. Like, if I'm working on a winter album, I would probably have this No Bound collection. But we'll talk about more about these on another day, because that's another favorite product of mine. All right, but also in the lid, we have room for um, our adhesive, scissors, anything that you frequently need in this um, clear pouch when you're done. You can just zip it up for transporting so nothing falls out. Um, on the side here, I have my cutting patterns. Now these are in little mesh pockets so that I can see them. These are the ones that I use the most. Um, I love it there, I love it on the side because I don't cut every photo into a circle or an oval, but when I need it, because of the spinning wheels here, I can just spin it towards me, take what I want, put it back, spin it back so that everything's more accessible again. All right, um, down in here, I keep my, my trimmer, which I also cut photos with, my corner rounder is inside, and then we have a place for little um, pens down here. I actually keep my Sharpie, my precision point adhesive, my chalking pen, and then my regular um, ballpoint pen down here. Um, those are things that I'm always looking for that I don't use all the time, but when I want it, I want it. So it's a great place to keep those right at my fingertips. So let's go ahead and pack up so that you can see how easy that part is as well. Again, if you're working out of the bag, most of your stuff is in the bag and you don't have to pack up all that much, but I do need to pack up my mats. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those back in. Um, my circle and oval cutter, it'll either fit in these little bags or right in the top. I'm gonna throw it right in the top. And then, um, that's everything I wanna get in here. Just wanted to give you um, a, a tip. I don't store mine in there, but if you have the stash and fill binder, it does fit perfectly in this bag. Um, so keep that in mind. I'm gonna go ahead and unsnap this so that it will shut up for me. And if you have one of our lightweight seat cushions, or if you have one of our, or a lunch bag of some sort, um, you can um, actually attach that to the front if you want to, 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 to bring it with you. Um, even the cup caddy really will ride there if you would like to th thread it through your cup caddy. All right, um, now what I'm gonna do is lift my handle. I am going to pack up these little bags, which are amazing. I have um, three of them. One for my big punches, one for my smaller punches, and then one for my border maker cartridges and just little extras. And um, these, because of the nice durable lid, they will ride nicely on top of our cart. So it is time to go, my friends. So follow me to the crop. Wouldn't you like to have one of these under your tree? Thanks for watching. Bye. Okay. Go. Hi. Hey.